संकटनाशनम श्री गणपति स्त्रोत्रम प्रणम्य शिसा देव गौरीपुत्र विनायक भक्तावास स्मरेन्म आयुष काम्थ प्रथम वक्रतुंडक तृतीय कृष्णपिंगाक्ष गजवक्म चतुर्थक लंबोदर पंचमच विकटमेव सप्तम विघ्नराजेन्द्रम धूम्रवर्णम तथाष्टम नवम बालचंद्रम दशम तो विनायक गणपति गजाननम द्वादशनाध्यम यठे नर न विघ्न भय तर्विधिक प्रभो विद्यार्थी लभते विद्या धनार्थी लभते धनम पुत्रार्थी लभते पुत्रा मोक्षार्थी लभते गति जपेद गणपति स्त्रोत्र षड्भिर्मास फल लभे संवत्सरेण सिद्धि लभते नात्र संशय अष्टभ्यो ब्राह्मणीभ्य लिखिवा यपे तस् विद्या भवत्सर्वा गणेश प्रसाद श्रीनारदपुराणे संकटनाशनम श्री गणपति स्त्रोत्र संपूर्ण साक्षा श्री आदिशक्ति माताजी श्री निर्मला देव्य मेडिटेशन। Take a deep breath in and out three times at your own pace.
surrender ourselves at Shimataji's lotus feet and seek permission to do today's meditation. Shimataji, please give us permission to do this meditation. Open both hands in front of Mother with pure faith in our heart. Right hand to the left heart and request Mother, Shamataji, please come in my heart. Shamataji, please make my heart pure, normal, and claim it. And please establish your lotus feet in my heart. Shantaji, let me worship your lotus feet in my heart. Both hand in front of mother. Say Shri Ganesha Mantra once. Om Samev Sachat Shri Ganesha Sachat Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devye Mother, you are very much the Ganesha with me. Please come in my Muladhar. Clear my Muladhar, open my Muladhar chakra and enlighten our Muladhar. Left hand towards mother and right hand on the ground. Shri Nirmal Ganesha Mantra. Oh, Ameva Sachat. Shri Nirmal Ganesha Sachat. Shri Adi Shakti Mataji. Shri Nirmala Devya. Mother, by your grace, I am innocent. Both hands in front of mother. Shri Ganesha Gauri Mantra. Oh, Ameva Sachat. Shri Ganesha Gauri Sachat. Shri Adi Shakti Mataji. Shri Nirmala Devya Namaha. Mother. Please make me innocent.
left hand to the ground and right hand towards mother. Shrikatikeya Mantra. Om Eva Sakshat Shri Katikeya Sakshat Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namunanti Mother, please make me worthy of your appreciation. Please make me worthy of you. I will say Sarva Raksha Santri Mantra once. Om Eva Sachat Sarva Raksha Santri Sachat Shri Adi Shakti Mataji Shri Nirmala Devi Namaha. Both hand towards mother. Enjoy our attention becomes pure. If any thought persists, just say no thought, no thought. We request Mother. Mother, please take us to deep meditation states. Please connect us to all pervading Father. Take us to your rock state. श्री विराट के पांच मंत्र श्री गृह लक्ष्मी कुबेर विराट ओम त्वमेव साक्षात श्री गृह लक्ष्मी कुबेर विराट साक्षात श्री आदि शक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्यै नमो नमः श्री ब्रह्मदेव विठ्ठल विराट ओम त्वमेव साक्षात श्री ब्रह्मदेव विठ्ठल विराट साक्षात श्री आदि शक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्यै नमो नमः श्री विष्णु माया विराट ओम त्वमेव साक्षात श्री विष्णु माया विराट साक्षात श्री आदि शक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्यै नमो नमः श्री विठ्ठल विराट 
साक्षात्ठल विराट साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम श्री निरानंद साक्षात श्री निरानंद साक्षात श्री आदिशक्ति माता जी श्री निर्मला देव्य नमो नम surrender ourselves to your lotus feet seekers of truth your experiment with truth here at the level of the throat or the shuddhi chakra as it is also known is to try to communicate with your body and soul it is important to understand one thing you cannot force this process it is a completely natural and gentle process by which one achieves unity with truth or reality all that you have to do is watch listen and feel all the pictures all the music all the sounds of nature are so chosen to help transport you into a realm where your senses become sharpened to enable you to feel the peace before we come to the experimental part of the program we will repeat the introduction Now how can you experiment with truth Truth is what it is it cannot be changed and it cannot be conceptualized but truth can be felt Your own body is the instrument of truth In every human being energy centers are to be found on the autonomic nervous system These centers are connected to every cell in the body through the nerves and are called chakras the centers are a direct instrument of the truth they reflect the destructive as well as the constructive behavior of man towards his environment and towards himself fear what stress anger greed egotism and so forth i wish the nerves in the body to overlay the energy centers of your autonomic nervous system With the help of the nervous system one can discover the reasons for a positive or negative attitude to life and the reasons why sicknesses occur How does that work In the sacrum bone just below the base of the spine resides a power This power is known as a female or motherly primordial power and since ancient times it is known as kundalini The limbic area on top of the head integrates all the systems in the body and is therefore the principal control center for the body. Your experiment with truth starts 
when your kundalini rises up through the spinal column to enlighten this limbic area. When this happens, a new dimension of perception is achieved through which you learn to understand the energy flow from your body to your hands. All the nerve centers and consequently all the organs reflect their condition in the hands and on each fingertip. Through this subtle system of perception, that is the system which registers the truth about everything, you are able to discern your own mastership and what should be your right conduct towards God, mankind and nature. Whatever you will now feel is information about the true conditions of your energy centers. And that is your experiment with truth. You can feel it in your hands, above your head, in your body, in your heart. The awakening of Kundalini and man is the blossoming of the seeds which all the great incarnations have sown. Lord Krishna, Lord Rama, Lord Jesus, Lord Muhammad, Lord Confucius, Lord Lao Tse, Lord Buddha, Lord Jnanadeva, Guru Nanak, and others. Kundalini is the power which enlightens mankind. And through this, a new step in evolution is achieved. Her Holiness Srimataji Nirmala Devi has developed a simple method by which Kundalini, through her love, can be spontaneously, gently, and effortlessly awakened. Shumataji's desire is to give whosoever wishes it their enlightenment through this motherly primordial power. The easiest way to raise this majestic mother within you is to just put your right hand on top of your head as Shimataji is doing and ask, Mother, please give me enlightenment. Shimataji calls this process Sahaja Yoga, the spontaneous connection of our attention with the all-pervading power of love. Desire to be one with reality. Desire to be one with truth. Why do we need to communicate with our body and our spirit? Every action that we make has a reflection on our autonomic nervous system. When our actions or behavior are constructive, then we feel a cool breeze over the palms of our hands or over the top of our head. Whenever our actions or behavior are destructive, we will feel a warmth or tingling under the skin, on the palms or in the fingers. Our hands are like a talking map with which we can decode which are the energy centers that have a problem and also understand the reasons for the disturbances in our behavior. For example, if there is a problem in cervical plexus number five, this will manifest itself on your forefinger as a prickling or a warmth. Or on a larger scale, it will manifest itself as an injury or sickness in that area of your body. The same happens with the other fingers, when their corresponding centers on the autonomic nervous system are not in balance, when they are disturbed. So you become your own master, insofar as that you will know your own problems and the reasons for them on the deepest, most subtle level, and you will also know how to tackle these problems.
Please sit upright and relaxed, cross-legged on the floor if it is comfortable. Or if you choose to sit on a chair, place the feet a little apart without shoes. Rest your hands, palms open and upward on your lap. Accompany us further on a meditative journey. Take time for this experiment. Know your own self. Yourself to become empty. Empty from egotism, thoughts, guilty feelings, fear, worries, and all worldly desires. As the great master Lao Tse says, create, but do not possess. But do not cling, protect, but do not command. That is the hidden, true virtue. Empty your mind of all thoughts. Let your heart be at peace. Watch the turmoil of beings, but contemplate their return. Let yourself go. Let yourself be carried along. You don't do anything. The mother within does it all. She does it all. In reality, you are timeless. You are here and you are now. Give yourself up and allow yourself to become one with the pictures, with the music. Let go of your thoughts. Let go of your desires. Let go of your worries. Let go of your fears. Do not feel guilty. The ocean of joy awaits you. Kundalini, like a gentle breeze, flows within you. When you feel your own purity, your own innocence, the peace and love of your being, you feel free and you feel light. Do you feel tingling in your hands? Then you are feeling your spirit. It is talking to you. Listen to it. Listen to yourself inside. Meditation begins when you feel a cool breeze above the head. Let yourself go. Let yourself be carried along. You don't do anything. The mother within does it all. She does it all. The apocryphal of John. The Holy Numa, Greek for breeze or spirit, 
known as Zoe, life, the mother of all. So the mother sent the Numa, which is her own. If you have felt the cool breeze, then you are thoughtless, happy, satisfied, without desires, free inside. You are strong and as broad as the sky. If you have not felt the cool breeze, then there are problems in this center in the neck, center number five. The nerves in this center are irritated and manifest this as a tingling under the skin and in the forefinger. Or you may have a physical problem with the throat, nose, ears, or eyes, which are all controlled by this center number five. So you become your own master, because Kundalini shows you, if you cannot let go. Even if you have only felt the cool breeze once, or a prickling on the fingers, carry on with your experiment with truth, and you will see again how your body, your spirit, communicates with you, but only if you give up your guilty feelings, your ego, and your fears. The blue sky helps you to clear your energy centers. Look at it often, and let yourself be led by the mother inside. In reality, you are not guilty. And when you are in the present, you will feel the coolness on your hands and above your head. If you don't feel the cool breeze, or you'd like to feel more of the Kundalini, then the following exercise with Shimataji Nirmala Devi will help. Please sit upright and relaxed. But if you choose to sit on a chair, rest your hands, palms open and upward on your lap. Place the feet a little apart without shoes. Please now place your right hand on your neck as shown. Now, now turn, turn your head to your right. right. Here, you have to say with full confidence 16 times. Please believe what I said. 16 times. Mother, I am not weak at all. The power of electricity helps to soothe the tensions in this area. Mother, I am not guilty. I am not guilty. <coughs> Mother, I am not guilty. See again if you can feel a cool breeze above the head. Perhaps your muscles have relaxed and your heart is feeling lighter. The Upanishads. Prana is breath. Maitrayani. Rajapati made himself like air and penetrated into the inner beings of the people to enlighten their consciousness. The breath was his body. People from all over the world who are practicing Sri Mataji's method of meditation can confirm these experiences, some of which Sri Mataji related to those attending her public program in Prague in 1994. First time you have felt the subtle power of divine love. Only thing we have to understand that in modern times, yoga is not illusion, it is collective. We have to become collect so to progress further and to grow into a great tree of Sajoga, 
you have to come to the collection. You may feel very much better now, very much really relaxed. But you have to know your responsibility because you have to give this to others, to spread this to others. So first you come to collecting and become masters. Some people become masters instantaneously. But you have to be perfect in your knowledge. As to the centers, as to the community, as to the whole divine laws. I, I have, have given, given more than 4,000 lectures in English language. They are very subtle. So, so you, you have, have to be in a state, state where you can, can understand, understand and absorb. absorb. So, so please, please, all of you, come, come to collect. collect. I have seen, seen when I come, come there are many, many people, but, but they get lost uh, till I come next time. time. So, so they, they remain, remain at the same state. state. Then, then how, how can you help, help yourself, yourself and, and help, help your country, country and, and help, help the whole world? world? You don't, you don't have, have to pay for anything, anything even if you come up collecting. You don't have, have to pay. pay. Whenever you feel this cool breeze, then you are in reality. You are feeling the truth. You can discover this truth in all cultures. Try to feel the truth in the Red Indian and in other cultures. The North American Indians had a strong sense of collective awareness and behavior, which embraced not only people and animals, but the whole of nature. Chief Red Elk from the Sioux tribe. When I hit out, then I hurt myself, and tear at the earth, then I feel how my own body bleeds. Whatever my hand gives out, my body receives back. Before you judge anyone, you must walk in his shoes for two moons together. Seneca, a man who only thinks of himself and tries to take advantage of everything can never be happy. As you want to live for yourself, so live for others. <laughs> You can test everything in your daily life with the help of your inner system of perception. We wish you good luck and enjoyment. In our next edition of Experiment with Truth, we will be considering the master.
silent meditation for two minutes.